What is good YouTube? Watch you here with a video on the Justice League. So this is the second Justice League movie we've done in under a week. So if you're new to the channel, we do Marvel and DC videos all week long. So Zack Snyder has finally revealed the original Justice League ending because if you remember during reshoots, Joss Whedon basically changed the whole of the movie and Steppenwolf turned from sub-villain to the overall villain. Although there was an easter egg towards Darkseid, he said for Darkseid, they really did change the end of the movie. So what was supposed to happen at the end of the movie was Steppenwolf failed, so Darkseid was supposed to come along and kill Steppenwolf and then it was going to set up Justice League 2. So Zack Snyder was asked a fan question on Vero which is kind of like a picture community social network website which isn't that popular. So it was asked a question about this video is in the Justice League Blu-ray extras which means technically Zack can talk about it right and he responded with this. It's from the end looking into a boom tube which is most likely looking into apocalypse where dark side hangs about where dark side rules so it literally confirms to me a massive justice league fan i got to go to the justice league movie early got to see an early screening media screening for it it confirms that we were supposed to get the massive dark side reveal at the end of the movie and dark side himself was supposed to kill steppenwolf so it's kind of annoying that this kind of stuff comes out because according to what ray fish has been saying re recently there was enough footage that he actually filmed they could have made two movies out of the first justice League movie but for some reason warner Brothers seems to think they know better than what Zack snyder thought obviously how good man of steel is compared to the Justice League movie, they should have stuck with the original storyline. They brought Joss Whedon in because Joss Whedon made Age of Ultron so good. Not. So guys, let me know. Are you a bit disappointed that we now found out that Darkseid was supposed to be revealed at the end of the movie? And this does coincide with a DCEU leaked on Reddit that I did a kind of leaked plot breakdown at well well before the movie actually came out. I did a leaked plot and it literally said the exact same thing that Steppenwolf kills is killed by Darkseid and then we see a massive kind of dark side apocalypse teaser scene and it looks like they're looking into most likely what is apocalypse so guys i will keep you up to date with all the latest and greatest justice league news although the movie has come out for such a long time Zack snyder keeps teasing us on vero although there is the release of snyder cut movement on the internet i do support it i just don't support the die hard kind of we like Snyder is God kind of stuff because yeah he's very good but you, if you want to follow DC stuff you have to just go with whatever they're trying to do no kind of petition is going to make him release a Snyder cut but Zack Snyder I just want him to come out and show us what Darkseid actually looked like and show us the whole story I don't think it'd be breaching Zack Snyder's contract with WB as he is still working on Wonder Woman and he did work on Aquaman as well so Zack Snyder, if you listen to my videos, I know you don't. Just please release the script for the whole movie so we can finally find out what was Darkseid actually supposed to do. But this does reveal the ending for the real Justice League movie, the original cut. Anyway, guys, please like, subscribe, and comment. And I will catch you in another video very soon. Catch ya later.